guys, Rear McCoy 411. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, please take the time to subscribe, click on the notification bell for all my upcoming new product reviews. Uh, not yet tutorials, but a lot of information that I'm learning on my natural hair journey that I'm sharing with you guys. Today, I am doing, I've had to do a co-wash. Yes, I had to do a co-wash. Now, the line that I'm introducing to you guys is Eating Body Works. I received this back a couple of months ago, and I've been using it, but not as often. So I use the Eating Body Works Cleansing Co-wash. I'm going to be applying my curl defining cream because I'm going to be using the LCO method. So first and foremost, I have my leave-in conditioner by eating. I have my curling cream. They have here a natural styling elixir to prevent freeze and it's sulfate free. So we're going to use that. We're going to put that in there because I'm going to create a wash and go using these products. Now, I'm going to combine these products with my melanin. I think this would be a good combination. Good combination, especially if not anything, for the moisture. Okay? So we're going to go ahead. I'm going to get everything open and going here. We're going to apply in the LCO method. Now, you guys know that I've been using the Virgin Hair Fertilizer, and since I co-washed, I will be adding that back to my scalp. So, that's going to pretty much be my own, okay? So, let me tell you this. If you're shampooing, if you're doing a co-wash, if you're doing a rinse, if you're doing anything, get you one of these little shampoo brushes. What you feel... After you have used this, it's so refreshing, guys. So refreshing. I found other ways to use it as well, which I am going to apply my hair fertilizer off camera. I'm going to come back. We're going to redampen my hair, and we're going to put the leave in. We're going to use the cream, and then we're going to bring those two together with the melanin and see what type of wash and go we can get. So hold on for just one minute while I apply my hair fertilizer. All right, guys, I'm back. Now you would think by looking at my hair, my hair has been dry for years. And I literally only stopped to apply the fertilizer. But let's get going. I'm going to separate my hair. And I'm going to work with this top piece last. I'm going to start in the back. Woo! If it's not one thing, if I cannot say that my hair is growing, I can definitely say that thickness has definitely taken a part of my hair. All right. First thing you have to do if you're low porosity is make sure that you have warm water on hand. Warm water opens up the shafts and the cuticles on your hair strands. Now, leave in. That's our first. And now when it comes to these products, these products all smell like coconut. There's another line out. And I haven't had the opportunity to try it just yet. But I will be getting it because this is a very this is a very moisturizing line. It smells just like coconut. The slip is great. Oh yeah. So I make sure I work that all in. And I take my brush, go through it. Then my cream is my curl defining cream. These now this line works very good on twist outs and stuff as well. Twist outs, three strand twists. If you're just doing a puff or something like that, it works great for that. 
But I was in the mood for a wash and go, and I just wanted to put these two products together and see what I got. See what I got. So I've put that in, I've worked that in. Now I'm going to put in the melanin. that in. I hope I'm not too close. But I want you guys to see. And that's working in the lead in. Then I'm going to apply both of my creams. This is the Curl Defining Cream by Eden. And it's very smooth. It's very, very smooth. Opposed to the melanin, the melanin is more thick. But when it comes to eating, the eating is smooth, it has a smoother texture. The brush is basically just to bring all the products together. When I finish, I usually do like a shake towards the end and you'll see that. So, I've showed you guys how to do this. I'm going to go ahead and do the crown, my two sides, and I'll come back to you when I do the front. Alright, hold on just a second. Alright guys, I saved the big part for y'all. The grand finale. <laughs> the grand finale. We're really going to have to soak this part now. And sometimes you do have to go back and rewarm your water, honey. Rewarm that water. But, do what you got to do. Make sure those strands are open, those cuticles. Especially when you got a thick piece like this. Go all down up in the middle of it. Let's go ahead and add our cream. I love the way this makes my curls look. I love the way so far it's making my curls feel. And that's not too weighed down. That's why sometimes I don't go in with the gel because I don't like the hard, I don't like the hardness of gel and I don't like the cast, you know, I, I don't like the, I just don't. Now, like at the end of the night with the wash and go like this, I can put it up in some pineapples easily. I don't have to worry about no flaking or anything the next day and it's just easier for me. But not saying anything against anybody who likes gel. Because some of the, my favorite YouTubers love gel on their wash and goes. But like I said, when you're doing YouTube and you go in, you, you pretty much say, okay, well this part will work for me and this part won't work for me. Like you're watching this and you're probably saying, well I'm going to have to add the gel. By all means, sis, do it. It's what is to each his own. You know your hair. Now I'm adding the melanin. This is a baby, so I am going to wear it down though to the front. No part. Now, both of these products are white, so it's not that my hair is having a, a chemical interaction. They don't like each other. I won't be able to tell that for sure, for sure, for sure, until it dries. But I think these are going to pair good together. 
And if they pair good together, kill a combo, kill a combo, kill a combo product review. <laughs> kill a combo. The way it has my hair feeling right now. Hmm. And I know how the whiteness of these can come and go. Oh, yeah. This is my shape. And then your hair is going to grow. Make sure you're drinking a lot of water. If you have to refresh your wash and go, use aloe vera juice. That's what I do. I use aloe, aloe vera juice on my wash and goes. Instead of refreshing it with water, and I say refreshing it, it's like when you come back one day and it, it may be a little dry and you want to, you know, freshen it up. Instead of adding more product, just use some aloe vera juice. It's good for your hair. This is shingling. So, alright guys, if you're new, go ahead and subscribe. I'm going to cut the video here and I'm going to come back and let you all see the finished product. I'm not going to be blow drying it or sitting under a dryer or anything like that. I am going to let this air dry. Okay, so I will be back and it, if you would like to add some lift to your hair, just get you a pick or something and lift it up and this would be the perfect time because it's getting ready to dry so you can just lift it up and play with it and just get it the way you want to get it get it the way you want to get it like that clump right here pull it apart shingle it not just pour it apart All right, see y'all in a minute. Not for the takedown, but for the dry hair. And once again, I'll be showing you all the products. Y'all, these products are bomb. And I already know they're going to be bombed together. So all I can say is killer combo. Killer combo. You start adding things that you got to what you got. You'll be amazed at how these products will work. Amazed. So, see y'all guys in a few. All right. All right, guys. I am back um, with another killer combo. Killer combo. Killer combo. This is my wash and go. My hair is about 80% dry. And as you can see, the curls are popping, the white is gone, and the products I used was Eden Body Works, Cleansing Co-Wash, Curl Defining Cream, Leave-In Conditioner, and Melanin. So, a combination of Eaton Body Works and Melanin you can give you a killer combo for a wash and go with no gel. If you're into the no gel thing. And this is it. This is it. Tell me what you guys think. Leave a combo. Leave a combo. Leave comments down in the description box. Uh, give me a thumbs up for this video. If you have any questions about the products, 
leave the questions down in the com in the in the comment section and I will answer your questions. Melanin thick moisturizing very good product. Doesn't smell like anything. Smells like shea butter and a lot of other good healthy butters and for your hair and the coconut the curl defining cream the coconut shea eating body works it smells like coconut it's light it's not heavy it's not it's not thick the thickness comes from the melanin this product is light so those two products together with some water will give you a great wash and go with no build up residue as you can see it's all shine because both of my products are moisturizing so and the hair fertilizer on the scalp it's not on my hair it's on the scalp so I'm taking care of my scalp I'm taking care of my hair and I'm going to let my hair just flourish flourish hey right, guys you guys have a blessed day Remember, keep God first in everything you do, and stay tuned for other product reviews coming from Real McCoy 411. If you're not subscribed, you need to go ahead and subscribe. It's only about to get better. Only about to get better. You guys have a blessed day.